guys welcome to my channel well today i received my ipsy for may so if you're interested stick around and don't forget if you enjoy the video like subscribe hit the notification bell thanks okay well let's jump in Ooh, this is cute okay well we have a brush that obviously didn't fit in the bag but this month's bag is a gold rose gold glittery bag and it says ipsy at the bottom and it has this cute little tassel and i guess we'll go ahead and start with the brush since it's outside of the bag and it is a Farrah brush and it's two-sided definitely for the eyes looks like you know the one side is for doing the crease and the other side is for blending so yeah that's a nice nice brush nice and soft oh that side's really soft and nice and tapered so very nice i like i like fair brushes so this is a good one okay well let's see what's in our bag and of course there's a card but we'll look at that in a minute wow this is interesting this is a pretty large size of bella pierre cosmetics hd finishing powder high definition translucent powder and as you can see this is really a, i mean this is basically a full size it says that it's 0.25 of an ounce but this is pretty big oh my gosh and it comes with the cutest little powder puff <laughs> how adorable so okay well that's good who couldn't use a little finishing powder or translucent powder and what's great is since it is a little bit smaller you know like the uh, Laura Mercier I have is an ounce so that's much bigger um the packaging is nice and uh yeah I'll put this in my purse okay the next item we have is the beauty crop and Let's see, we'll go ahead and open it. It looks like it's probably a single eyeshadow. Oh my gosh, that is really cute packaging. Oops. That is super cute. I mean, it's it's plastic. I mean, it's very lightweight and inexpensive, but at least it's, you know, got a cute design. Let's see how the product is. Hmm, what is this? And I take it back. This is not a single eyeshadow. It is a sample size of Sardinia Sand Bronzer. So I'll go ahead and open this up and show you guys. It's definitely a little bronzer. And I'll do a quick little swatch. Once again, you got to love these little samples because they fit perfectly in your purse. And there's the color. I'm very pale, as you can tell. So, but yeah, that's cute. Never heard of the brand before. Um, let me know if you guys have ever heard of it. And let's see, the next thing we have is Nature's Cartel Multi-Purpose Stick. Ooh, I love these. It says the color is Glow Ball Awakening One Illuminator. Okay. <laughs> hope it's like a peachy or a pink I mean the all-in-one sticks are awesome and here is the packaging just a cute little multi stick oh it's an illuminate I'm so silly it's a highlighter duh but I guess you can use it anywhere and I just swatched it down here oops just swatched it right there it definitely has a nice texture it's very creamy and soft it's kind of like a duochrome where it has like the gold pinky kind of tones but very smooth very nice they threw me off when they said multi-stick i thought i was excited for our lips cheeks and eyes and let's see the last thing we have is a pixie which i haven't tried much of their products it's a pixie skin treats h2o skin drink pure hydration gel Okay. Intense moisture gel instantly rehydrates skin. Okay. So there is what it looks like. And let's see. It does have a safety seal, which I always like that. And let's get it opened and I'll give it a little try. Wow, this is really sealed. Okay, there we go. I'll just put a little bit. Ooh. 
comes out fast. It's definitely a, a kind of a watery gel, not a really super duper thick gel. Feels very hydrating. Oh, it smells wonderful. I know that's really weird, but if something has too pungent of a scent, even though perfumes don't bother me, I just don't like them. It has a little bit of a flowery fragrance, but it's very, very light and very smooth and very hydrating. I mean, I don't know if you can tell, but I just put it on the top of my hand and I'll kind of compare them. But yeah, this is really nice. So we got the bronzer, the illuminating stick, the HD translucent powder, the hydrating gel, and the Ferra brush, all for $10. And you know, that's a really good deal. The Ferra brushes, I'm not sure of the price. I'll take a quick look at the card. Since these are more sample deluxe sizes, you know, it's kind of hard to put a dollar value. You know, it's just a matter if it was worth the $10 to you, if you will use the items. Yeah, so I don't know any retail values on these items, obviously, because they are deluxe samples. I definitely think the translucent powder and the brush and the cleansing gel and the illuminator and the bronzer, I think with all of these products, and quite frankly, I'll use all of these. I mean, I can't imagine, you know, unless the hydrating gel just doesn't work for me, but I always enjoy trying new products. So yeah, I'm pretty happy. $10, five new little things to play with this month, and a uh, few things I can throw in my purse. So... I think it was a great month. Let me know below if you have an Ipsy subscription. Did you get these same items? Did you like them? And if not, do you think these items were worth $10? I know a lot of people get the Ipsy Glam Plus, but since I already get the Boxy Charm for the full size items, I'm going to keep getting this one, I think, just to see for $10 if the value stays what it is, because it used to be the Ipsy Glam Plus. You could only get if you already had a subscription to Ipsy and now they've changed it where anyone can buy their Ipsy Glam, Glam Plus box for $25, which it is a little more than BoxyCharm. So I don't know. I have mixed feelings. Let me know what you guys think. And as always, have a great day. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.